Hello, my name is Charlie, and I would like to introduce my hometown, Trinidad, California, to you. I was born in Southern California, but I was raised in Northern California and have lived off and on in Trinidad for over 20 years. I love this village very much, so I consider it my hometown. Trinidad is a very small, sleepy fishing village in Northern California. Located about 400 kilometers north of San Francisco, Trinidad has a population of only 311 people and has California's last natural deep water harbor. I would like to introduce some things that I like about my beautiful hometown and hope that you will visit there someday. In this picture you can see Trinidad Bay. The Yurok Indians have lived on the cliffs overlooking the bay for over 2,000 years. The first European sighting of Trinidad Harbor was by the Portuguese navigator Sebastian Rodriguez Cermeno, but he did not come to shore. The next European visitor was the Spaniard Bodega, who, on Trinity Sunday, June 9, 1775, claimed the area for the King of Spain and named it La Satisma Trinidad, and this is how Trinidad got its name. The next picture shows the Trinidad Pier. This pier was built after World War II by the Hallmark Fisheries Company in 1945 and is still used by locals and visitors alike. However, the original pier was actually a ramp or skid used for processing whales when Trinidad was an active whaling port between 1923 and 1931. In this picture, you can see the old Skid Pier. Today, Trinidad Pier is used by a small fleet of commercial and recreational boats that fish for salmon in the summer and crab in the winter. Also, Trinidad Pier is popular with sea kayakers and scuba divers. Next, I want to show you around the town of Trinidad. You are now looking at Trinidad's Town Hall. Like most small towns along the west coast of America and Canada, Trinidad has a police station, a volunteer fire station, a post office, a supermarket, a gas station, a fish bait and tackle shop, a boat launch, a church, gift shops, art galleries, an elementary school, bed and breakfast, coffee shops, seafood restaurants, a local museum, a marine laboratory, traditional houses, and, of course, a lighthouse. However, I think Trinidad's greatest attraction and my most favorite place is Trinidad State Beach. Trinidad State Beach is clean, quiet, and beautiful. People come from all parts of the world to enjoy this beautiful natural park, hike its trails through spruce and redwood forests, and walk its empty beaches. While you are there, in the fall you might see California gray whales migrating offshore, or in summer see a black bear eating wild berries. Bring a picnic lunch and sit outside and enjoy the wild and natural beauty of the north coast of California. And best of all, Trinidad State Beach is completely free. I hope you have enjoyed my slideshow of Trinidad, California. If you visit Trinidad, please be sure to visit some of these places, especially the beaches.